Here we have the 2015 Discovery. Do best point out any marks, any imperfections and things like that. So start the front right alloy and tyre here. And overall, this alloy is in really good shape. You can only just see a few little bits where it's had a little bit of curbing there. Uh, it is very minor. Otherwise, the rest of it's all nice and tidy from what I can see. And we've got a general grabber tyre on the front right here. It looks like absolutely loads of tread. Just over 7.5mm of tread, so plenty of tread there. Come around the right hand side. I've had a good look around and it is a very, very clean car. Uh, from what I can see and we've got the back right alloy and tyre here as well again this alloy is in really good shape overall we have just got a little bit of a almost like a little bit of a chip the alloy there again very minor here's something you will get with the age of a car and another general grabber tyre loads of tread on that one on the back right there coming around the back of the car here as well it's all nice and tidy. Of course, you've got the rear parking sensors. I've been really struggling to find much to point out. You've got a few very, very light scratches on the back of the boot, but they are really tiny. Stood a metre away. You can hardly see them, to be honest, but still worth pointing out. That's all nice and clean in there. I'll show you the rest of the inside in a few minutes. I've just got a few light little scuff just on the back of the plastic there, light little scratches, but nothing major at all. Coming around the back left hand side now, and that's all nice and tidy as well. And we've got the back left alloy and tyre here. And this one also in really good shape overall. I mean, I'm not, I think with the others as well, I hadn't actually noticed, but the uh, centre cap's just a little bit worn and corroded. And you have got a bit of corrosion near the middle of the alloy on this one. Otherwise, the rest of it's quite clean. Another general grabber tyre. And again, absolutely loads of tread. So much tread on this. So that's good. Coming around the left hand side. And that's all nice and tidy as well. And this is probably the worst bit I can find on the car. Um, even then, in my opinion, for the age, it's really not that bad at all. It hasn't cracked any of this. It's just a little bit of a scuff here and a few light scratches and a little bit of a mark on there. But from a metre away, it is very minor. To be honest, some of that may polish out. Um, but yeah, it's... Not that bad for the age of a car. And the front left alloy and tyre as well. And this one's in really good shape overall. And we've just got a little bit of corrosion around the centre cap there, but otherwise, the rest of it's nice and tidy. And again, we've got absolutely loads of tread here. Yeah, won't have to worry about the tyres for a while. Now come around the front. Of course, you've got the front parking sensors. It's all really nice and tidy around the front. I've only noticed a few very, very tiny stone chips. They are really minor. Uh, it's actually really hard to, to see where they are. That's probably the biggest one even then. It's really quite small. And then just another... A little stone chip there, and that's just a bit of water there. And the bonnet as well, really good shape. A few little stone chips. Like I say, it's something you will get on a car this age. A windscreen, free from any major chips or cracks or anything like that. Uh, we have got two keys with this one as well. And now if I show you inside of the car as well. So we've got the driver's door there. That's all nice and tidy. Overall, a few light little scratches down there from being ultra picky, but again, very minor. Of course, you've got the Meridian sound system on this one. Uh, driver's seat. That's all nice and tidy as well. I think that'll come off. I think that's just a bit of food or something. 
and as you can see just over 21,000 miles on the clock in fact I'll just start it up and as you can see that all runs exactly as it should do steering wheel that's all in good condition a few little marks on here so that'll probably come off with another clean automatic lights just down there obviously this all works exactly as it should Got the sat nav on there as well and when i put it into reverse i've got the parking aid just pops up on there as well heated front seats like I say, all works exactly as it should. And we've got the front left seat here as well. Again, that's all nice and tidy overall. A few little marks on the bottom of the seat there, but again, I think that'll come off. Front left door. And the rest of the inside is nice and clean. And now, if I just show you into the back as well so we've got the back right door just there a few little marks on here but again that's just me being ultra picky back of the driver's seat and the middle seats here in really good shape obviously have, has been used by the looks of it but like I say, it's in really good shape overall. And you have got the seats in the back as well. There we go, that's the Discovery. Overall, a very nice example for cars eight years old. Thanks for watching.